how you download files from Mediafire that will remove. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get the link that will remove. I know these links will remove. You're going to want to go to Mediafire first. Make sure you log into your Mediafire account. Now you can log into Facebook. I've known you can do this for quite some time. But yeah, I just I just found out about this just recently. So I'm going to delete the file that I want. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to move this to the trash. Go to the track. I'm gonna hit delete. And now I'm gonna go to this file. And now what you're gonna want to do is this channel. So go to a page that was blocked. You're gonna want to copy this part. Copy. Now you're going to want to go back here and click a, a file that you have in your mind file. And you're going to want to do this. And you're going to want to do comma. Um, and then you're going to want to paste it here. Like so. And then you're going to want to go to file. Delete that. Question mark. And now when you hit enter, it's going to show the file here, and then um, you're going to click this, and you're going to hit not download, you hit download. And you're going to hit copy file to, and then my file, and you're going to copy file the folder. And now when you go to file, um, it's going to show up here, it's going to be this file. And then now you're going to go to download. And now when you go to download, see the download link? I can click this. And now it's going to prompt me, hey, do you want to download? There we go, I right clicked it. It's gonna prompt you, do you want to download? And now you can either open, save it, and it'll actually download it. Just wanted, just wanted to make this quick. Um, and that's how you download files from Mediafire that are basic, that have basically been, um, removed, basically.